All right, here's a, a question where we're asked to find uh, the uh, maximum area. As soon as they use the word maximum or minimum, that kind of thing, I know that I need to find what the vertex of some kind of quadratic function is. But I'm looking for vertex, so I'm thinking these, this formula, figure out this, and then plug it into the function wherever you see an X, that's what you're going to have to do. So let's look at the question. I have a rectangle, and it says the length and the width have a sum of 72. So the length plus the width must equal 72. Now, um, I want to know what the area is. So the area of any rectangle is length times width. And I want to get this area to be a maximum. So uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to solve this equation for either L or W. It doesn't matter which one. Let's move the W over. So it'll be L is equal to 72 minus W. That'll be my equation uh, for length. So now I come over to this side here, and length from right there is 72 minus W. And the width we just leave. Now, right here, I have this quadratic equation. Uh, I guess I should FOIL it out first, or distribute it out first. So W times 72 would be 72W. And W times W would be a negative W squared. Rewriting this in the proper format, I would write minus W squared plus 72W. So now here I've got that quadratic thing from which I want to figure out the vertex. Okay, so let's figure out the, the vertex. So the vertex, uh, to find the x co coordinate of the vertex, so I'm looking for uh, an x value and a y value. To figure out the x coordinate, you do this part here. So minus b over 2a. So it's minus whatever b is, all over 2 times whatever a is. Uh, a is the thing in front of the squared, so that's negative 1. That goes down here. And b is whatever's in front of that next letter, so 72. Now, simplifying a little bit. Uh, negative 72 divided by negative 2 would be equal to 36. So 36 is... Uh, the x-coordinate of the vertex. So I could put a 36 there. Now, the question says what dimensions give the maximum area. Okay, so I need to find out the dimensions. This one here is whatever w is. That's what we're solving for over here. So that's what the width is. So the width is 36. But up here they say the sum of both is 72. So length plus the width is 72. So if the width is 36, I should be able to determine what the length what the length is. So I take this over and subtract, and sure enough, you get the length to be the same as the width. So really, it's not a rectangle. Well, it's a special rectangle. It's a square. So the length is 36, and the width is 36. If the question, so 36 and 36. If the question asked, well, what is that maximum area? You could just multiply those two, because that's how you figure out the area of a triangle, or of a rectangle, is length times width. Or the other way you could do it is take this 36, no, not that 36, this 36 here, take this 36 and plug it back into the equation wherever you see a W. And you'll find you'll come up to the same thing. Hopefully that helps with that question.